Hi everybody, Joe for Jazby's Hobbyland here. 2016 Panini National Treasures Racing. It's a one box break. Everybody gets four numbers. Uh, spot number 100 gets all the redemptions. For example, if you get a Joey Logano number 27, if you get randomized number 27 and you get a Joey Logano 27 out of 50, that goes to spot 27. So we sold 25 spots. Let's copy that and quadruple that list up. There's one, two, three, and four. So you should see Ace's uh, Last Spot Mojo Star four times. There's one, up there is two, right there next above J-Max name. Three, right there, and four. So whatever number you get on that one will be it right there. So let's randomize that list five times, three and a two. This is our last break of the night. One, two, three, four and five so adam with number one and jmac with any redemptions that come out that goes to you justin after five times all right so let's copy that and let's just kind of put it in this list right here And there's all your numbers right there. Now, people might tr want to trade numbers, so I'll pause the video really quick to see if anybody wants to trade numbers. Uh, we'll just give it a th like 30 seconds or so, and then we'll go from there. But there's your list right there, folks. Be right back. All right, welcome back, everybody. Um, there were no trades in that break right over there. So as you see, here's the official printout. So on the 7th, National Treasures Racing, one box break, number one. There's everyone. Just a quick reminder of what you got once again. Just a quick one box random number break. Uh, spot 100 will get any and all redemptions out of that one box. So we'll see how many cards are supposed to be. Oh, it says what? Seven cards per pack? Well, we'll see. All right, so let me pop this case open first. All right, Bowman, have a good night, man. Um, hockey and Jaspies will be back on Monday, Bowman, and I will be back on Tuesday. Have a good weekend. All right. Oh, bright red boxes. I, I wish they would have done like a, a black and white checkered flag or something like that. That would have been cool. So one, two, three, and four. So TJ picks box box four. He is a sorcerer, so he's been he's been nailing the numbers all week long. Um, okay, we're gonna use the true random number generator one through four. Whatever number is generated is the box that we will open up for our one box break. Number one from jaspershobbyland.com. Good luck. Ooh, box two. We're all a little tired, TJ. Maybe his sorcery powers were not working at the moment. All right. So we'll save these for another one box break for next time. And here is box two. Good luck. Got like a cool little NASCAR sticker there. Seven cards per box. Now in National Treasures Baseball, we've seen them kind of uh, stuff the box a little bit, but maybe we'll see what happens here. Nice, all right. Good luck, folks. So we're going to kind of slow play it like this. Looks like there's a book on the bottom. There you go, that's right side up, right? You can kind of see the cards right here too, okay. We got Clint Boyer, 8 out of 15. Nice, in the 5-hour energy. Uh, number 8 goes to J-Mac with that base card. First relic coming up is Chris Buescher, 9 out of 15. Relic, timelines relic. What happened on that day? 
Uh huh. Fall in blah 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 blah. Rookie of the year. Oh okay. Dover, right? I think that's in New England. New Hampshire, Vermont, something like that. All right, there you go. That was a nice day for Chris. Be sure, and that one will go to Tim Langston. Oh, here's Chris Buescher again. This time it's one out of five. That's a train whistle for Adam K. Out of five. There's Chris Buescher on that day when he put himself in contention for Rookie of the Year, learning things. Now, all aboard the Big Hit Express. Whoop, whoop. Nice. Our first autograph coming up, and that is 24 out of 25. Brad Kozlowski. Nice. 24 out of 25. Number 24 is Jeff Hensley with that one. Nice. Nice, Brad Kozlowski. Autograph. A redemption coming up. That's automatically for J-Mac, who has spot 100. Nice one, J-Mac. Bam. Oh, nice. Carl Edwards. I like Carl Edwards. Signature fire suit material silver. You got to redeem this. I want to see what this looks like. Carl Edwards, nice one for J Mac and Spot 100. Rewarded for staying up this late. All right, thanks, man. You got to thank Ram.org too, obviously. All right, so for Spot 100, nice Carl Edwards. That last race of the season was really good too. Really classy guy. Quad Relic and Auto, right on the card, Denny Hamlin, 21 out of 25. Nice. It's on a pretty thick card stock as well, if you look at that right there. What are the materials here? Enclosed race, use material, and autograph, blah, 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 blah. No, it doesn't, doesn't say what it is, but maybe we can figure it out. I mean, obviously, part of it, some of it's probably the suit itself. Maybe it's all from the suit. Kind of hard to tell on that quad relic right there with the dark colors, but that's a nice one nonetheless for number 21, Denny Hamlin. Nice autograph too, Denny. Number 21 is Clyde the Glide with number 21. There you go, Clyde. And the last one is uh, Ty Dillon, fire suit, one of one. Wow. Look at that. Jumbo signatures, one of one going to Adam K. Wow, that is cool. That is pretty sick, actually. That is nice. I casually follow NASCAR, so I, do, I actually do think this stuff is cool. Ty Dillon, nice autograph right on the book, and nice NASCAR patch right there. That is pretty sick, ladies and gentlemen. I gotta take a screenshot of that. <laughs> Look at that. That is awesome. That's the kind of stuff that's in here, folks. How much did this break set you guys back? This is break number one, folks. That's random break number one. 20 bucks, uh, 20 bucks gets you four numbers. That's not too shabby. Jaspyshobbydad.com will have the next one, folks. Thank you very much. Really appreciate it. This is Joe. We'll race with you next time.